Um, let's see, I have this, uh, Martin Cito Pants one, which is a flash game- pause, please. Is a flash game tier list. Maybe this will jog my memory a little bit. Because <laughs> on I remember a lot of them, but honestly, my memory is not that good. I do remember the world's hardest game, yeah, I definitely remember that shit. Let's give this video a try. I'm sure this will- I'm sure this video won't be chaotic at all, knowing the, uh, knowing the original author. <laughs> Off to a great start. Have I seen this before? I almost feel like I've seen this video before. Hello again. <laughs> Welcome back. Flash games. A great relic of the Yeah, Henry down. Stickman did used to be Today, on Flash. we'll be ranking them in a tier list to determine which games are truly the best, and which are objectively poo tier trash. Yeah, if it's like, like, it's like less a... chaotic than Maxor, but it's still chaotic. Like, it, it maybe should come with a warning. Kid, then you probably spent a great deal of time <laughs> How's the volume, by the way? We good? Websites playing Flash games. I have fond memories of sites like Congregate, Nitrome, Cool Math Games, and... Okay. I remember cool math games. I don't remember the other two. There was also mini clip. Yeah. Each of these had their own personal identity and a catalog of games. Some good, some bad, and some. Ultra just Kill Flashport. Any game. day now. Today we'll be playing these games and pitting them against each other to determine which game is truly the best. As you may have heard, Adobe is ceasing support for Flash Player at the end of the year, so I figured I would make this video. 2020 was when it died. Damn. Most. Keep in mind, this list is 100% objective fact and cannot be argued with. Anyway, mm -hmm. let us begin. <laughs> we'll start our journey with D tier, because as we all know, low end <laughs> mediocrity is far worse than abject failure. Okay. We begin our sure. journey with a true classic Bloxors. Probably a good game. I remember so many, like, versions of this. Like, I, I, I definitely played a game that was like this, but it looked different. Like, it wasn't, it wasn't this exactly. Kind of a goaded, like, puzzle game, though. This game scared you. Interesting. But, simply put, fuck this game. It really puts into perspective just how little functional brain cells I actually have. <laughs> yeah, sure, the game is probably good, but oh my god, just get in the hole. <laughs> okay, yeah, you know what? I do remember this one. Yeah. This hole right here. He doesn't fit horizontally, so you gotta roll him in vertically. Dude, just get in the fu- Every level gets harder, and every waking minute I spend here decreases my IQ by several points. It looks menacing. Huh. Trash. Don't ever talk to me again. People <clears throat> speedrun that game? Okay, I feel like on, I shouldn't be have... surprised by that. I should not be surprised by the fact that people apparently speedrun that game. Bubble trouble. Wait. <clears throat> bubble struggle? Laura? I don't Shoot remember bubbles. this. Bubble split into two more bubbles. Shoot more bubbles. Thrilling. Once again, I find myself utterly incapable of predicting the path of a bouncing bubble. Fuck! <laughs> the first few levels are fairly easy, but then... This shit actually looks kind of crazy, yeah. He's ranking it D tier, Fuck! but... This game also features a two-player mode designed to instill as play much it. hatred for your fellow man as possible. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> this game fucking sucks. Get out of here. <laughs> Sucked at it then, still do. Around... Mm, Medium detail, we have Interactive Buddy. This game is- Okay, this is bizarre. not a game. It's the only game I know of that allows you to brutally assault ex-president George W. Bush. Nice. This guy is our Interactive Buddy, who we can tickle, pick up, sing him a tune on the radio, and then set him on fire, throw infants at him, and nuke him from over. Oh, fuck. Do you guys remember Powder Game? It's basically like Noida without the game. Like, you just create stuff and then blow it up. That shit ruled. I think Noido was, like, inspired by it. Like, heavily inspired by it. This game appeals to the sadistic mass. Is that Flash? I wonder if you could still play that. Like any classic CIA interrogation, there isn't actually an end goal. Of course, if you consider buying more powerful fun tools, then there is one. To get items and weapons, you need money, which is earned by repeatedly throwing bowling balls into the poor guy's head. Yeah, the, also uh, kick, use the, money to kick dress the buddies like the version of this that I know. The person that plays this grows up to be a killer. <laughs> yeah, probably. Probably. This Their is somewhere on the pipeline. Different people, <clears throat> like Republican, Democrat, Gorilla Fighter, <laughs> Teletubby. Who the fuck is Tom? 
The creators of Kick the Buddy have fallen off hard too. Is that is there like lore? Is there like a lore video that someone could send me here? What's up, Britta? My wife, who is who is very far away from me right now. <laughs> that sounded like sarcasm. Britta is actually not home right now. <laughs> the game also features Just different me, modes. Sad. Like blood and gore. What the fuck? D tier. Weird. Yeah, that doesn't seem Up like a road. game. I've played this game a lot. I played this it's on mobile. Great. I didn't realize it you started off as Flash. Feed this little dull bludger his Centrelink payment. Wonderful. It's kind of satisfying to get the thing to get all. I kind of like this. But really, it's boring. It's DTL, boring. Okay. Fair ah! enough. This list is Moving objective. So here, we have Duck Life. This game plays like Learn to Fly, but worse in almost every way. They made four of these, and they all play more or less the same. You get your duck, train him to become an elite cross- That was another funny thing about Flash games, was that there always was, like, tons of sequels to some of them. Like, why? <laughs> it just made no sense. Like, yeah, this game needs a shitload of sequels. Get on it. Fit athlete, and then race I guess people played them. Ducks. My strategy in this game is quite simple. Make your duck a literal supersonic jet for the flying event, and nothing else on all other events. Mm -hmm. Yeah, sure, the other ducks will gain the initial lead, but your flying will be so dominant that they will still lose. I'm gonna go <laughs> ahead and assume that this measurement here is meters, which means our duck at max speed can go one kilometer per second. Then, feed your duck- Was that what I thought it was? I'm gonna go ahead and assume that this measurement here is meters, which means our duck at max speed can go one kilometer per second. Then, feed- That's Castlevane! <laughs> <laughs> Am I wrong? I, it, it's such a short snippet. That's fucking ultra kill music. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> I did, this is like the last place I expected an, an actual ultra kill reference to show up. Eat your duck the most potent <laughs> anabolic steroids really you can buy and have him race. Now watch here as our duck starts out slowly, losing our initial lead to the other ducks in the race. The other ducks get to the cliff first, leap off and begin flying. This video was made in 2020, too, so Ultra Kill wasn't even, like, other. that popular at the time. Sorry, I just keep pausing this, but... <laughs> like, what was the date on this? It just says, two, what, November 6, 2020? That's crazy. <laughs> Martin is based. Although, what I will say about this video is, like, for some, for some of the games, he's going, like, in-depth, like, analytical about this shit. And then other ones, he's just like, it fucking sucks ass, bro. <laughs> D tier. But plebs. Easy. Uh, C tier. That's C a mark of a good tier wild. list. Next Sometimes up, you just know. Extreme bump loader. You play as this runny away guy. Cool game, but very Wow, simple. I do not know the this controls one. controls are literally three buttons. Just hold the right arrow and press up occasionally. You start in bump loader España, <laughs> running away from a bull. Next up, you go to either Holland, or Deutschland and run away from women. <laughs> Stay safe, king. Then you get two of three choices. Just don't choose wow. Switzerland and you'll be good. Seriously, the ski guy does not mess around. Fuck! Once you've been chased through the entire country of France in 40 seconds, you're Put ads all over gone to a subscription thing they constantly advertise that costs like $8 to a week. The Wait, what the must... fuck? Constantly putting your face saying to buy it and the ads, oh my god, the ads for kick the buddy now. Well, I mean, they're, they're probably making bank off of, like, the three Kick the Buddy fans in the year 2023, you know? <laughs> no, that is crazy. Use the surrounding fat guys and launch yourself to the upper floors. After you bounce off of the Swedish population, you go back to Spain and run back into the stadium with the bull chasing. Wow, okay. CT. Simple and good. Up next, we've got Heli Attack 3. I don't remember you so many of these. Guy. Who spends his days shooting down helicopters with a pistol, grenades, and many This looks like a uh, metal slug Incredible. or something. Occasionally, helicopters drop said weapons for you to better shoot down the other helicopters with. But very bad. Each level has a quota <laughs> that you must fulfill. Once you destroy the local rotary wing, not bad, base, just you, you know. The next level. The next like level has stronger helicopters. Wish for you to brand. <laughs> Once you reach the final level, you don't win. You enter the endless mode, which gets boring quite quickly. C tier. Commando. Right. Ah yes. The first Commando game. This game is horrendously difficult. Yeah, I knew Quap was made on Flash. The game. What the fuck? Bruh. You play as a British Commando from World War II, tasked with single-handedly okay. destroying the entire German army. 
you can shoot in exactly two directions, directly forward and straight up. The game also has pretty terrible input lag. I, play, I don't Health remember this one really either, but apart. I played like Some every game on mini clips, so I would be absolutely shocked if I didn't play this one. is just plain rude. Oh. Ooh, he <laughs> and you only get three lives. Oh my god! Hence why I wasn't able to finish the game despite playing it for a couple of hours. <laughs> Besides the hard difficulty, the game is actually pretty fun. When you come across a tank, I'd recommend using grenades like this. Nice. Oh my god. See you. That game needs some starting off crazy with crazy speedrun strats. Run two, a true staple of the cool math game. If run was so good, well, I was about to say how come there's no run two, but there is a run two, is what I learned today. <laughs> Games universe. In this game, I feel like, you play as a faceless gray blob. Oh my god! No, I don't know this one. That runs. Wow, it so runs many of these I don't remember. And keeps on running. Ah! Yeah. What is it running from? We don't know. There's but also a run three. Speculate. I should have known. Finishing each level is really quite easy. The difficulty in this game is collecting these yellow dots. There is one. I hope that Wide Putin 64 is represented on this. I'll be honest. I never Although that's a Unity much, game, <laughs> but it's still pretty decent. B tier. Learn to Fly One, the first game in the Learn to Fly trilogy. Now these games. That looks a lot like pop. the duck one. You play as this penguin who gets epic trollolled by a Wikipedia article stating that penguins are flightless birds. <laughs> Is this like a whole a ass like cutscene? Collects investment from someone and takes flight with the help of specially made. Yo, you guys remember Line technology. Rider? Once again, I have to say it: this game is Paul. Learn to fly too. To upgrade your equipment, you must gain money. To gain money, you need to fly for long duration at high altitude and high speed. At the end of the game, you get a fast glider Yo, so and a talk about rocket and take off into the distance. Only to smash into a the giant iceberg that was somehow Man. out of sight. I guess I don't. I feel like I probably played these, the but down. I don't remember series, the lore. Decent game. B tier. Next up, we toss. The turtle. The best turtle cruelty simulator on the market. That's this disturbing. Is, this you is get a just kitten and cannon. a slingshot and must fire this poor turtle as far as possible. This is literally just Much kitten like cannon. Much like the Learn to Fly series, you earn money to get upgrades. These upgrades are then used to go further to earn more money and buy more upgrades. Now I spent around an hour and a half trying to complete this game before I realized that it never actually ends. <laughs> Once you unlock all the best stuff, there's nothing else to do, and the game gets boring. Still fun though. B tier. Tanks. All right. A classic multiplayer oh, these are experience. Great. Get your friends and complain vigorously about the shitty game design. Shoot guys, <laughs> airstrike guys, nuke guys. I had one of these on my guys. phone too. Very nice. Tanks. Beautiful. B tier. Off the rails. Very solid game about two sombrero wearing cacti traversing the Mexican desert on a hand powered rail car. Good soundtrack, nice art and animations, and the cacti go. Andre, Andre. Very good. <laughs> B tier. Very good. Next up, we have Shopping Cart Hero. You play as this dude who throws himself in a shopping cart repeatedly so off the cliff for clout. You can earn this clout to buy jet engines, afterburners, and friends. I would have loved this one. I, I was big into jackass clout, around this time, you know? Sequence. Stuff like, like that. Tony Hawk. Very nice. B Can't believe I didn't play that one. Skywire 2. Not the most famous game out there, but certainly a good one. You're a cable car that needs to deliver these little tic-tac dudes to the end of each level, uh -huh. presumably on some fucked morning commute. Every mistake you make, one of the Tic Tacs is ejected and sent to a watery what? demise. The music is solid, the level Wait, what design is the and game? art are really good, the game is just good. Do you just like Except speed up and slow down? And go away. B tier. Huh. Finally, Papa's Games. All of them in Yeah, general, I remember these. they're pretty much the same game. Fuck! For this video I played Papa's Pizzeria, which involves the creation and poisoning of pizzas to deliver to unsuspecting customers. Do you have momentum you and shit? Order, okay, okay. Place God knows what that is in a specific pattern. Throw the pizza in the oven for a specific amount of time, and then slice it up and give it to them. Bro, I wanted to come over. The difficulty <laughs> comes with more customers and more orders for you to get mixed up with. Uh. I'm a really shit multitasker, so I find this game mentally challenging. High B tier. Good games. All right. The Welcome A tier. All right, we're getting From there. Here on, we get what is known as the Ooh Yeah. Yeah, zone. Happy Wheels the is games crazy. Make you go. Ooh Yeah. Our first ooh yeah of the video is Age of War. This game is a true classic, and its music is what I used in the mm. intro. The game plays out on a 2D battlefield, where soldiers patiently line up and wait their turn to whack each other. 
You have a base, and the enemy this has a This looks cool. Base. I've, so uh, I'm surprised I didn't play destroy this. Their base. The game has three types of units to choose from per age, and you can level up your base to create stronger ones. To cheese the game and win easily, sick. I'd recommend abusing the pause mechanic. It resets <laughs> all the animations of all the characters on screen. What's meaning up, if Chico? you have a ranged unit, he can fire at pretty stupid rates. Would you recommend. played that game a lot? Interesting. 18. I guess apparently I missed a bunch of games. I Because I felt like I played a lot of Flash games, but I have only recognized maybe like a third of these. There are so many that I have not played. Final Ninja Zero. Yet another. Yo. Oh, yeah. You play as How this much did I guy. miss? Just 11 minutes of this video, and that's it. <laughs> he needs to run to an elevator. You know, in Super Fighters? Uh, run, the name sounds jump, familiar. Slide and jump off of walls. Go invisible for sneaky stealth time. Fling lots of shurikens at the bad this guys, looks sick. and also use shurikens as a grappling hook. Very fun, and quite good. A tier. N. You run, you jump. Sometimes you jump off of walls, sometimes you jump into mines. And oh, sometimes yeah, you I know this judge game. how high that ledge is. That's the game. Epic. To win, you have to reach this thing, which opens this door, and then run into... Isn't there a door. Steam version of this, too? ...increase the time you have to do each series of levels. In total, there's something like 500 levels, which Jesus. is pretty pog. A tier. I think Good I job. own that on Steam. Stick War. This game plays like Age of War if yeah, it was, was a campaign say. instead of a single battle. You mine resources to create units and what make said fuck? units go and smack the enemies dead. Completing levels allows you to upgrade your existing units and sometimes access entirely new ones. To win, you smash the enemy We have Mountain Blade Bannerlord at home. The game gets progressively more difficult as more mechanics and units are introduced. My pro gamer tip would be buy lots of archers and use these mage guys. They can spawn these dumb little fucks at a very high <laughs> rate while the fucks. archers go. Very good. Nice. Hey, very good. Learn to fly three. Here it is. Our penguin returns once again. So we skipped Not from one to three. Does that mean two is S tier? To conquer and I heard it in chat. The third one is shit. But I don't know anything about these games. Atmospheric flight. Apparently. But to go beyond and reach the moon. Two is great. This game okay. is a lot like Learn to Fly 1, but instead of sideways, you go up. Astounding. There are a few factors that determine the height of your flight. The capsule you use, the rockets you have access to, the side uh -huh. boosters you attach, uh -huh, uh -huh. the weight of the system, and the starting explosive you use. Anyway, yeah. Good game. <laughs> A tier. Pretty good. Very good. Ah, uh, yes. What he says. A Very true good. classic. Bloons Tower Defense 4. Yep. This game does everything a Tower Defense Wait, why, game why can do Why 4? Because right. they're all, like, kind of similar, right? But why why pick 4? The goal is extremely simple. Stop the horse of balloons from making it to the end. To do this, you must place dark flinging monkeys. was the best monkeys, one in Flash? Okay. Flinging monkeys, I don't remember. What, I played launches, a bunch of these, but I don't remember monkeys, which one's which. Lane monkeys, etc. This game is great. A tier. Fat Cat. Fat Another cat. game from the best Flash game site out there. Nitrome. You play as two characters at the same time. This so little owl dude nah, nah, the mouse nah, nah, nah. and this big old flying Jonker. with the keyboard. To win, you simply get the big boy I might to the play, end of I might play some Flash time. games though. The owl can shoot if I can get him working. Thing, and the cat has a giant laser it can use. Like any Nitrome game, the graphics and sound design are really good. Everything this looks satisfying, cool. And the game is just generally Kinda pog. I don't think I ever well played done, any Nitrome games. <laughs> We're done with A tier. Has the video gotten -tier. louder, or have I just Officially, gotten the big boys zone. first grader? Starting off S tier, we first have Happy Wheels. Is that Tuhu or to Toho? To is that how you, I, I don't know how you say that. I always mess it up. That oh go shit! Through level. Happy Wheels. There is somewhat realistic physics, and each character in the game can be exploded into Toho, several okay. small pieces. The game is very open-ended, with literally millions of levels available to choose from from the level browser. Yeah, I played a lot of this there game. There are a near infinite amount of ways your poor character can eat dirt. My personal favorites would be getting repeatedly shot in the head with a cross. I honestly thought, or I honestly forgot that like the goal of this game was to like get your person from point A to point B because I just took so much more joy in watching them get murdered. <laughs> like, I feel like that's probably like a universal experience, but if I'm a psycho for that, you know, it is what it is. It is what it is. <laughs> so, harpoons and this giant combine thing. Okay, okay, S -tier. okay. <laughs> it is S tier. Mother load. This game is truly one of the best and well-deserving of the big boy title. 
Need Bank, a quest? You play as this mining thingy that needs to go down and collect valuable resources. The game starts with our good friend, Mr. Nuthouse, giving us a briefing on what we're supposed to be doing. <laughs> Holy shit. Like the video if you show unconditional support and admiration for Mr. Nuthouse. Yes, of course. You get dropped off by this dropship thing onto the surface do of Mars as a well-paid miner. Is this Mr. the surface of Mars? Unconditional the game's Okay, yeah. Surface of Mars. This is the surface of Mars? <laughs> yeah, sure. Sounds good. As a well-paid miner. Mr. Nardas informs us that things have been kind of weird around here lately, so he's willing to pay a premium for miners like us to go down and dig. The this dig reminds dig, me of, uh, has anyone played the game SteamWorld Dig? That game's kind of fun, and it, it's like a fleshed out version of this, basically. I feel like I played this, but I can't remember for sure. Nada sounds like a shitty gas station hot dog. <laughs> That's awfully specific. There's a green ass surface. Yeah, what is Mars hiding? What is Mars hiding? Valuable resources you come across. Even things like ancient religious artifacts and Martian fossils can be found. You also get radio transmissions from other people. This guy looks like he's seen some shit. Holy fuck. Presumably mining as well. Does he know? What, what the fuck are we talking about? <laughs> Does it sound like I know? No, I don't know. <laughs> probably nougat in the middle. In the middle of Mars? Yeah, probably. Hello, what did I miss? You missed about 16 minutes of this Martin Cito pants video. <laughs> and that's about it. <laughs> the deeper you go, the we stranger continue. they become. Mining and selling ores gives you cash to spend inside three shops. Equipment, upgrades, and This fuel. game looks kind of... I would highly recommend upgrading your fuel awesome. tank to a higher capacity because it runs out exceptionally quickly. Once you've dug down to 4,000 feet, things start getting pretty strange. The radio communications are weirder, there are lots of impenetrable rocks and lava pockets, and sometimes, the dirt just explodes and kills you instantly. Nice. Fuck! Epic. Past that 5, is epic. Feet, it's too dangerous to use the drill, and explosives must be used to mine out dirt. At 6,000 feet, the altimeter goes all weird and doesn't tell you how deep you've gone. But you keep digging until you find the bottom. Once oh at shit. the bottom, you enter a giant cavern, and who else to greet you down oh there but the trustworthy <laughs> and admirable Mr. Nuttus. Yes, of course. His name backwards is... Satan. Oh shit! Mm. So naturally, you hit him with the- <laughs> Who could have seen this twist coming? Well done. Oh fuck, it's Mecha Satan. Once again, you hit him with the- This game looks amazing. I thought it was Abraham game. Lincoln. S tier. Kinda, I could see Commando. it. I could see it. Two. The first shooter game that I properly played as a kid. In it, you <laughs> play as the same guy from the first game. Except, he's learned to shoot at angles other than 90 degrees. Whatever the first game did Holy wrong, shit. this game did right. There are four levels, each with three levels of difficulty. You get nine lives to complete the game, which may seem like a whole lot more than Commando 1, but it's actually still pretty low, especially considering <laughs> how hard the later levels get. This time, our boy Yo, has been sent to the crazy ass bosses of the hell. The it is baby's first Japanese Metal Slug, army, absolutely. Including whatever this thing is. This Kong. A Metal Slug is fun as shit. Like, there's a pizza place by me that I used to go to growing up that had, like, a Metal Slug machine uh, in there. And I, I used to love playing that. Metal Slug is so sick. And the art style is great. Like, unbelievably good art style, too. Like, it, it holds up still. Like, it still looks good. I suck at it, but it's so fun. Yeah, I mean, it's made to be hard to steal your money. <laughs> it's literally designed to steal your money. But it is fun. It is fun as hell. I also, uh, my other favorite arcade game is uh, Galaga. And I actually was kind of good at Galaga. Now, I realize that, like, saying that paints, like, an expectation. I'm not that good at it. But if I like had to, if I had to get like a, a decent score at any game at the arcade, uh, Galaga is, is what I'm what I'm going for. To save my life, gun to my head. Yeah, yeah, you got to know all the little tricks, like how to get the other ship and stuff like that. But yeah, that game fucking rules. Fu with an O, a warrior dude, a giant flying crab. What about Polybius? I don't. It sounds familiar, but. I don't, why, why can't I find like a good picture of it? I don't remember it. 
It's just like another like space shoot 'em up. It's the gaslighting game. Wait, what? 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 What's happening? What? What's happening? Have I been? Have I been bamboozled? <laughs> like it, I googled it and it came up, but I just couldn't find like a picture. It's a fake game that people made up. Okay, that makes sense. That's why I found here. Let me show you what the Google results look like. <laughs> Oops. Wrong. Like, so a lot of it is uh, AVGN, but then <laughs> there's like so many pictures of like an arcade cabinet, but none of them look the same and there's never a picture of gameplay. <laughs> like... <laughs> uh, and the Samurai Rocket. There's a good video on it? I might have to watch that. I don't think Need I have too I many anymore. Flash game videos, There are way videos, more guns so. in the first game, and you get to organize them into a loadout. Meaning, you can carry more than one gun. Amazing. Great music, great art and animations, great backgrounds, great Scott game. Scott the Waz did a good video on it. I'll have to watch that. Learn to Fly 2. Now this game is not only Pog. It has gone beyond and achieved... Mega Pog. Mega Pog. Our brave penguin returns with one goal. <laughs> I love the cutscenes in this. He flew into in the first game. To do this, Pinguino has enlisted the help of this vaguely penguin-shaped dummy for use as a high-powered, nuclear-armed hypersonic missile. Once again, our penguin has collected money from a mysterious investor and is using it in his ICBP program. Yes. The P is for penguin. To raise money, we must I'm fly shocked for by a this long revelation. at high speed and high altitude while destroying as many natural landmarks as possible. There's a snowman, snow pile, mountain. Little iceberg, and finally, the wall. To effectively wall. destroy the wall, I would recommend attaching a nuclear warhead to our brave pinguino and firing. <laughs> oh, off that's just real. Distance. All right, great. Who played Club Penguin? I feel compelled to ask. Any Club Penguin enjoyers in chat? Or are you all too? Uh, are you all too young for Club Penguin? Yes. All right, good. I'm glad there were some Club Penguin enjoyers. Yeah, Learn to Fly 2 does seem like the best. Yeah, the just the Penguin stuff made me think of Club Penguin. <laughs> Parents wouldn't let me. Damn. Damn. I think I had, like, a free account, so there was, like, a whole bunch of stuff I couldn't get. Uh, but I had, I had a paid RuneScape account. Yeah. So that, that was mostly my vice, but I did play some, some Club Penguin as well. Played from like 2006, 7 to 2009 and a few years in Club Penguin rewritten. Wasn't there like some drama with that too? With Club Penguin re rewritten? Like the people who ran it were like like predators or something like something horrible like that. People got groomed by the mods on yikes. Yikes. That sucks. Anyways. <laughs> The cutscenes in this game Best go two. way Best harder the than they Amazing have any right to. Work. Incredible. How do they keep doing this? Raft Wars. The premier shooting people off rafts into shark infested Disney waters. Disney sued them. I'm yeah. also not surprised by ah. that. Little Slim Tim over here finds this big old diamond while digging around in the sand at a local beach. Wow, diamonds. The story is run in the newspaper, which prompts a bunch of different individuals to go and try take the treasure. You've got pirates, <laughs> vikings, gangbangers, your neighbors, these <clears throat> racially this was like the art style of every, uh, of every like edgy flash game at the time. Raft Wars went hard for no reason. I don't remember this one either. Why is the diamond so much more high quality than everyone? Yeah, it's a, it's a great question. It's multiple remakes of Club Penguin. I think that happened in one of the others and they had a security breach. Okay. I mean, the fact that it's believable is kind of the worst part. <laughs> You've got pirates, Vikings. Gangbangers, your neighbors. This reminds these, me of like <clears throat> funny junk animations. Racially ambiguous men. And whatever these guys are. <laughs> nice. Naturally, you repeatedly shoot tennis balls at them until they fall into the water mm -hmm. and drown. In the final level, your other neighbors have tied your parents to a tree who need to be rescued. You drown your remaining neighbors. Yes, of course. And rescue your parents to save the day. But then. Yeah! Sadly, your parents are evil, and also want the treasure. <laughs> so you drown them too. Shit. 
Yeah, this is just Angry Birds, isn't it? Well done. Everyone you know what is dead, but at least... What a game. You got the bread. S tier. Damn. Bloom's Tower Defense 5. Okay. Remember how I said BTD4 did everything right? Well, this game does everything even more right. <laughs> it adds heaps of features. Lots of new towers. Heaps. Multiple upgrade paths to choose per tower. Abilities. The monkey bank. Etc. During my rec- Kinda like the word heaps, but I feel like I only ever hear, like, Australians and, uh, New Zealanders say it. Is it cultural appropriation if I start saying heaps? Because I, I just kind of like the way it sounds. <laughs> the monkey bank? Yeah, the monkey bank was a game changer. I didn't know- do Canadians say it too? Interesting. I didn't realize that this was the one that introduced the monkey bank. Recording session of this game, I got I was a little kidding. past round. I, I was kidding about the cultural appropriation thing, by the way. I don't think anyone cares. 100, which plays more like a PowerPoint presentation Heaps. than an actual game. Very good. This game is quite big, so I really can't do it justice in this video. Just take my word for it. It's a great game. S tier. Age of. Me and Britta walk around our apartment saying no, like Australians, like nar. <laughs> I think I'm better at it than her, because she kind of goes like, nah. <laughs> but that's just, that's just how we talk. Yeah. What the fuck is wrong with you? I know, I know. I, I would like to formally apologize to any Australians that may be in my chat currently. <laughs> I'm very sorry for, for using your beautiful language in such a, such a vulgar way. <laughs> right, Age of War 2. Similar to the first game, but better in every way. You start in the caveman age, and must advance to higher <laughs> ages to Albania. acquire better units, stronger abilities, and more scuffed tactics. The ages are ordered a little strangely. First off, we got caveman. Fair enough. Next is Spartan age. stepping down okay. as well. Yeah, that's like 1000 BC. Understandable. Next, the ancient Egyptian Understandable, age. Understandable, Flippy. 4000 BC. Oh, yep. Yeah. Then we jump forward 5000 years to the medieval age, which is nice. full of fairies. Then we get Renaissance, Swordman. This all Handle makes sense sword, to me. Like nobody else does. <laughs> Rifleman. Will not hesitate to use his musket to teach a lesson. <laughs> <laughs> then we get Modern Age. Infantry Soldier. Will perform advanced combat tactics. Nice. Grenade Soldier. Will blow. Blow up, rather. Your mind. Wow. Nice. And finally, the Future Age. I will now demonstrate this how to beat this a, a game on the highest lost difficulty. Art. First off, understand that the only way to make money and XP is to kill enemies. This means if we want to maximize profit, we need to spend as little money as possible per each kill we get. For this job, we use the Chicken Smacker 9 million. The Chicken Smacker fires eggs at a very high speed <laughs> at enemy combatants, Holy doing shit. considerable damage for a relatively low cost. Then we wait until they're within Holy range before spawning in our own guys. Using this tactic, we can reliably make more money per unit than if there was no chicken smacker. Yep. Continue this until you get to the Egyptian age, where you spawn as many priests as possible. The chicken smacker seems OP. Make sure to upgrade both their damage and range. Once the audio I love starts how he has an entire you know strategy. Well. From this point, you most likely have a pretty strong lead and can simply spawn in ranged units until you win. Nice. Nice. S tier. Is that it? Well, that's it then. Okay, the that answers my worst question. flash games of my childhood. Wait a minute. What about Poo Oh god. Surely there's something that belongs down here. He didn't even do Kitten Cannon. This is like a- this is like a migraine simulator. What the fuck is going on here? This is what I see when I have a migraine. <laughs> Oh, is this world's hardest game? Okay, okay, I see. <laughs> we out here in Yodi land. Who to you? So, is that it? Can I finally leave? There's another tier above S tier. No. Ah! Uh, God? I see that. Is that so you can hide that from what? me, Martin? No. You missed a tier. What? You missed the tier, dumbass. Oh, this one here? Yeah. Triple S. Well, uh, I don't know any games that would go there. Sit tight, fucko. Watch this. <laughs> oh my god.
Oh, good God. <laughs> Is that? Oh my God. <laughs> Obama alien defense. I don't think I ever played any like Obama games, but there was a lot of Bush games when I grew up. <laughs> That's how old I am. I played Bush flash games, not Obama flash games. <laughs> Hello, gents. Thanks for watching this horrible mess. <laughs> He's not even going to go into it. When I to write this, I thought, Yeah, yeah I do remember JFK last video Simulator. Was pretty long. Let's do a short one. All right. Thank you, Martin, for a nice little background in Flash games. Um, <laughs> let me look at the Dumpster Dive channel. I love that there's a world record progression for the game Red Ball. Watch the Polybius video on your own time. Okay. There is, of course, good old Quop. What is this? This is a Reddit thing. The Polybius video is one hour. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Electric Man is the name of this, I believe. What would you do if there was a child right in front of you? Be very concerned. There's not much space in front of me. Is that the whole video? What what is going on here? Oh, there's sound. Okay. Okay, this is DMCA music. <laughs> just just to be clear, this is DMCA music. <laughs> wow, it's insane. There were so many games like this that I, I honestly can't remember if I played this or not. So many just like Stickman games. Do you guys remember Pivot? Or is that just me? Did anyone else use Pivot? Better combat than Bloodborne 2. This is what games will look like in 2007. <laughs> Insane. I don't even know what's going on. Is what he's doing, like, impressive? <laughs> I just <laughs> don't understand. Was there a Danny Phantom game that was just a direct knockoff of this? I would believe it. I'd believe it, yeah. This is lame as shit. <laughs> I don't know why. Yeah, I just don't know what's going on. There are, like, so many stick fight games that, like... Yeah. I believe you, Flippy. 100% that you were better. Let's see. Is this too long to watch? Yeah, it's an hour. <laughs> okay, these are too long. I don't know that I've ever heard of Red Ball, but apparently uh, there is a world record progression video for the game Red Ball, uh, and I've never... I have never heard of that in my life. That video seems interesting, but it's an hour long. But yeah, am I the only one who remembers Pivot? Pivot was like a um, like a really really rudimentary uh, like animation software, and it was basically just you have like stick figures and you could just move all their limbs around like frame by frame and like animate them. Just like let me look up a Pivot animation. <laughs> These videos must be so old. The most epic pivot fight in the multiverse? Hold on, okay, we gotta watch this. We simply have to watch it. Let me just make sure... Okay, yeah, shitloads of copyrighted music. That's fine, I guess. Just turn it way down. <laughs> No one knows what you're talking about. Take your pills, Grandpa. You've surely you've seen these animations before. This looks like a really high effort one. Like, this was way better than the shit I was doing with Pivot. I want to find like a really shitty one though. This is like. 
This one is actually too epic. <laughs> Let me see if I can find an example of the, like, the software in use. How to animate a fight scene? Pivot tutorial. Let's fucking go, dude. Here's a quick tutorial. Fight sequence planning is like a funnel, alright? Start broad, then narrow down to specifics. Bro, this guy is like... It's like storyboarding out pivot animations. This is, yeah, so when you open up the software, this is what it looks like. You just have like one guy, and that's it. See, this one's pretty good too, actually. There's got- I gotta just like find some really shitty ones. Red is angry because Blue made a joke about his mom. <laughs> I, lo I love this. This dude for a pivot animation is making story, goals, beginning, ending, rules, settings, stick personalities, etc. <laughs> you are mom. Okay, this is more like, this is more like theory crafting. Wait, let's see the full chart here. Story beats and chemo and special moves, and lastly, the actions that string everything together. This is basically just like keyframe animating. Yeah, this, this is more like what I remember these being like. This is like a fairly competent one though. Like, the movements are actually pretty fluid. Like, all the ones I made were terrible. Wait, what am I waiting for? You actually do remember this? See? I knew it! I knew more people would remember this. Th these were, like, all the rage at one point in time. I just want to find, like, a really, like, dumb cringe one. Epic pivot fight? This one has to be good. Recorded with Bandicam with the fucking... <laughs> You know this one's going to be good. Let's do something. No, too lazy. Aw. Help. This is like two steps from hell. <laughs> Get away from me, you freak. What? <laughs> you shouldn't have ran away from me. Oh, he fucking vored him. This is too epic, dude. Bro, call James Cameron. Avatar 2's been beat. Cinematography, masterpiece. Story, masterpiece. <laughs> yeah, the faces are a nice touch. Oh, fuck. Oh, you like shed his human skin and now he's in his lizard form. <laughs> Whoa, there's another one. I think it's time to show him what we really got. Are they going to like fuse together or are they just standing next to each other? Holy shit. Oh my god. He has a stand. <laughs> Uh. Oh! I will absorb you first. No? No Vor this time. The katana has come out, though. What is this? Okay, he fucking... Okay. Okay. Alright, just needed a second to process that. <laughs> Okay, they're flying. This is just anime. <laughs> he did the right card shit. Yeah. I feel like this has to be like a two steps from hell song or something. Oh, the other one came out of the ground. Doesn't feel so good, doesn't it? 
Nothing personal, kid. <laughs> Izaki plagiarized this. Accurate. Let's settle this. <laughs> Berserk 2. This is like Berserk 2, 3, and 4 all in one. Time to take that nap. <laughs> There's no way. There's no way he did a white credit roll and a white background, right? There's no way he did a white credit roll and a white background. <laughs> Goddamn masterpiece. A goddamn masterpiece. <laughs> uh, Epic doesn't even begin to describe it, brother. What a, what a beautiful masterpiece. Holy shit. Okay, I don't think I need to continue watching more pivot animations, but I could, this is like a whole rabbit hole. Oh, this one has 71 million views. Holy fucking shit. You said shitty ones? I'm not sure they exist. You know? This says a stick pivot tournament. Is this the same guy? No, that was Spark Dizzy. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, it's a whole tournament. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Should we gamble? Let's gamble. <laughs> I'm making a whole thing out of this. <laughs> okay, this first one is red red versus yellow. Submission period is going to be quick. All right, you ready? One minute. One minute prediction here. Red versus yellow. Does it, oh, it doesn't come up on the screen. I think I could fix this. Vote away in the meantime. Here we go. <laughs> Choose none. <laughs> All right. Get those votes in. Get those votes in. <laughs> <laughs> Satisfied with the points I have? Red. Alright. We got more points on yellow, more believers in red. Okay. Let's see what happens. Can't vote. I just closed it, sorry. Yo, yellow goes kind of crazy. Yellow wins? No, wait. Put 10k in right at the end. Sorry, I won't. Uh, I won't end it early next time. I thought we weren't gonna get any more <laughs> submissions. Yellow's kind of crazy though. I don't see red like stretching all over the place. Oh, it took your 10k. Shit, that sucks. Red wins? He, he took the arm. He fucking upgraded. Okay, so red wins. Alright, is the next fight... Okay, yellow and blue. Alright, 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 alright. <laughs> alright. Who wins? Orange. Or blue. I'll give you a minute. This will be P3. Red is sus. The 10k did go through. Yeah, I saw it after I ended it. That was weird, though. Big winners on red here. There's a lot to keep in mind here. The unfortunate thing about this is that you could, if you were a, 
a dishonest individual, you could go watch the video yourself and see what happens. But I know there's not anyone in chat that would do that. And if if I think you're rigging them, I probably won't notice, but please don't do that. <laughs> get them in. Get the votes in. This video is in my mind, pal. <laughs> I've memorized every move. Cheating for this would be so fucking funny. Yeah, it would be hilarious, dude. Just to get some fucking funny internet points. <laughs> Don't even know what this is called. Right, because the title of the video is behind my face cam. But I doubt it's hard to find. <laughs> Since you mentioned it, yeah, I might have uh I might have messed up by even mentioning it. Okay. About ten seconds remaining. I'm gonna just start it. Yo, re uh, whoa. Okay. Um. Okay. Yellow's still alive. Blue does have a hollow head. That's what I was gonna say. But he's also not doing. Oh, he's got a big knife. Dude, why does? Orange brought a whole fucking army. What the hell? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh? Wait, but he's got the sword now. He's it. How many weapons is Blue allowed to bring? <laughs> Red's, Red's fucking gearing up, bro. Alright, blue wins. What are we, okay, we're going black and purple next. Alright. Blue enjoyers win. <laughs> what an upset. <laughs> yes. The guy who brought like 50,000 swords wins. Insane. Insane. Okay. Black and purple. Get him in. I might just do 30 seconds for the submission period. Go quick. You got 30 seconds. I just don't want these taking too long. <laughs> I won't end them early. But just 30 seconds. Get him in. Snooze you lose. Thought left was blue because that was the color. Yeah, that, that one was kind of confusing, wasn't it? I'm going from left to right. So the the blue one will always be the left one. And orange or purple will always be the right one. All in. <laughs> oh, he's all in. He's all in on purple. We haven't even seen these ones fight yet, so we don't know what they're capable of. I think red red is cooking something. I, I think red is is a is a strong contender here. Right always win. Um no, I think red was I can't remember actually. I I can't remember where red was. 16k on purple. Red was left. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's what I thought as well. So it's not always right. <laughs> How will blue stab him if he can reattach limbs? We're going to have to find out. That's going to be a good match. That's going to be a good match. That's all I'm saying. That one's going to go hard. I'm, I'm curious what these ones have in store for us. Because we, have, we haven't even seen them fight yet. Taking purple because it's my favorite color. Fair enough. Fair enough. Respectable. The victor is bandy cam. Rigged. Oh. Black's got the smooths. Oh. These guys are fighting fair. Which means they suck. Wait, black turned gray. What happened? Oh, uh, what? <laughs> That's not fair. As if any of this has been fair. He's earthbending now. Oh. Does black get to evolve? <laughs> oh. 
I love the like fighting game hit stop. He's Thanos. Wait, what is going on? What the fuck? He changed his color. I feel like black is going to still somehow win this. I feel like purple has just been beating up on black too much for this to go any other way. What? <laughs> black didn't even get any like hits in. <laughs> All right. There you go. At least Garrett gets his points back. <laughs> uh, there you go. There you go. That, I don't, yeah, that was just, yeah, the, the creator of this is racist. That's the only way, the only way to put it. But yeah, Purple clearly has, like, yeah, he's, he's on some shit. He's juiced up. Someone drug test him. All right, green versus white. Go, go, go. 30 seconds. 30 seconds to put in for green versus white. Purple is cracked. Yeah, he's on crack. <laughs> he is he is smoking crack. <laughs> Simple as that. Out of who we have left, I, I want to see now that now that red has like taken a bunch of shit off of like uh off of the other players. I want to see red. I want to see red in action. It's all the right. It's not. I I swear, red was. I'm pretty sure red was left. But if that's if that's what you're voting based on, then you know what? By all means, go for it. By all means. If white wins, we confirm it. Hmm. Let's, let's see. I could just like scroll back and see. Yeah, red. Red is on the left. I'm giving you guys intel though. That's not. Uh, yeah, send it, send it on, send it on right every time, you know? Watch, and watch red go all the way. Left all the way. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna start it. Okay, green, quite the entrance. I can't even see- is white invisible? I guess that makes sense. He, he, he like- oh, there he is. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh! White's crazy? I don't understand why the background's changing. <laughs> Just falls over. I feel like the ability to go invisible is kinda OP. Oh, green is like time bending, I see. <laughs> I feel like white is just kind of like going invisible though. Oh! Nothing personal, kid. Is he dead? Bro, he fucking he killed himself! What the hell? Alright, alright, green wins. <laughs> yeah, white was throwing. He had like every advantage there. That was crazy. That was crazy. All right, is it next? Okay, it's uh, red, blue next. Or yeah, red, blue. Red. Who wins? Red. Blue. Get him in, dude. I don't know. I feel like I'm I'm worried now because I I feel like I have so much faith in red, but. Blue could pull- blue was like multiple knives and swords, yeah. Blue- blue was like endless- endless supply of sharp objects. And hollow head. I'm kinda worried now, I feel like he's being set up for an upset here. Like red is- holy shit, that is so many points on red. Who the fuck put those in? Oh my god, what is- what is going on? <laughs> is that a- is that Marino putting in like all his fucking points? <laughs> oh my- Jesus Christ. 
actually going to crash the economy. I'm going to have to I'm going to have to raise the fucking VIP cost. <laughs> okay, all right. That's certainly made it interesting. That certainly made it interesting. <laughs> Jesus Christ almighty. I just saw fucking like almost 300k come in. <laughs> oh god. Three people sharing uh like 250k points. That's crazy. That's crazy. That is wild. All right, let's get to it, I guess. <laughs> Either that or he pre-watched. Got my eye on you. Oh, fuck. He's turned... What? Is he shitting? Okay, here comes Blue. Hi. <laughs> Imagine he just dies. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. He's like shedding his skin or something. Come on, boys, at least give us a good match. <laughs> Is Blue dead? Okay, no. <laughs> Big knife. Okay, the biggest knife yet. Alright, we've... <laughs> Red is back to... It's back to being one-on-one. -on -one. Red kind of is the main character. Blue's got the schmooze though, holy. Red is the main character and blue is like the- Oh! Oh, he blocked him! <laughs> He's got a spear. Did he do it? No. The twist! I can't take it! My heart can't take it! Oh, he's taking his parts! <laughs> Let's fucking go! The Comeback King, baby! <laughs> Red wins! <laughs> Alright. We have not crashed the economy. <laughs> Oh my god. I was scared for a second, though. Holy. Alright, purple and green. I don't remember these guys as well, honestly. Can he die? I don't know. That's the thing. He got cut in half and just mended himself back up to full. My gut says no. Green was Matrix, purple... Oh yeah, purple was Thanos. That's right. Purple's on the gear. <laughs> He's cheating. All in on perp. Ooh, okay, okay. Man, I love how this started with bets of like a couple hundred and now people are like, you know what? Fuck it all in. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> Royalty color solos. Fair, fair, fair point. Fair point. <laughs> oh, man. This is crazy. This is taking an unexpected turn. This dumpster died. I didn't expect to be gambling on pivot animations. <laughs> Haven't won a single one. Rip. Maybe green is your is your lucky dog. If purple doesn't win, it's actual skill issue. Yeah, I would agree. Considering that purple can seemingly just upgrade at will. All right. I'll give it a couple more seconds, and then we'll start. <sighs> Hurts because purple is my current favorite color, and green used to be my favorite color. I think green is my... I think green is my favorite. All right, let's do it. I don't... I'm a little concerned, by the way, that blue is, like, still here, but just faded out. Is there going to be, like, a third place game? Or, like, what's going on here? That would be quite the twist. Okay. He's got he's just like kitted out. <laughs> that didn't Whoa, okay, he fell over. I was gonna say that didn't seem to have any effect.
Is this the original audio? Yeah, I don't know. It might be a re-upload. I'm not sure. He keeps freezing time, though. He's got the Adam Sandler click remote. <laughs> the only time manipulation device that I could think of. You can start shooting colors at him. Oh, he's injecting- Whoa! That's against the rules! <laughs> As if this tournament has any fucking rules. He's got a big fuck-off sword, too. Oh! Owned? He actually put the fucking moves on him. Whoa! Okay. <laughs> Alright, well he has been buried alive. Well, why are you- okay, he's dead, alright. Purple wins. <laughs> Purple wins. Purple wins. Okay, the question is, are we getting- okay, the- the blue dot disappeared. So we maybe aren't getting a third place game. Does it just get- yeah, it goes to red versus purple. Okay! Okay, this is it. This is it, boys. Red versus purple. For all the marbles. We need some fitting background music for it as well. Alright, get your votes in. Get your votes in. Making big trash today. Big trash moves. Hit the video and put on Gale's theme. The fight is gonna be like two minutes long. <laughs> uh, that would be funny though. I don't even know if we have an underdog here, you know? Like, red kind of seems unkillable, but purple seems like he has an endless supply of, of stuff to just pull out. So I don't know what to think about this one. Purple's got plot armor? I think red has plot armor. I think purple's been getting, like, softball fights. <laughs> you know? Purple's had it easy. I didn't end it. No, it's still going. You got like 10 more seconds. Put on order? Oh, that's the play. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wait, I kind of want to hear what like the, the music is though. Yellow clapped in one minute <laughs> and he came back. Yeah, exactly. Back from the fucking dead. Maybe his luck has run out? That's true. That's true. He could- I feel like he's just gonna, like, graft one of, like, Purple's, like, mechanical arms on and just own him with it, though, you know? Okay. Time's about to run out on the vote. <laughs> I've been requested to put on... Slave Night Gale theme. Is there, like, an extended version of this? Theme extended? Phase 3 extended. No, that's phase one extended. Phase three, here we go. 31 minutes. Okay, wait, we need the we need the build up. We need to we need to hit the drop just right. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh my god. Dude, he's owning him. Oh, wait. Parried? Oh, what's blue mode do? Oh my god. Jesus Christ! It never ends! <laughs> oh!
Oh! What happened? What happened? You missed? No! Wait, they both died. No, don't tell me. He's unkillable. He's gonna grow back. He's gonna grow back. Is he dead? Okay, <laughs> he's gotta be- he's gotta be dead. No, dude! Purple wins! I thought blue had the plot armor. For red. Blue. No, oh, bro. Holy shit. Alright, pay out the purple believers. I lost it all and lost it all again. Oh no, you were right. His luck ran out. Purple wins. Take this, you purple bastards. Enjoy your trash. Wow, that was that was a fun time. I didn't expect that was a twist that I did not expect this this stream to take. <laughs> Why are we so invested in a pivot video? Dude, you guys were like, I I read the message verbatim. <laughs> let's let's get you your pills, Grandpa, when I talked about pivot. And now do you believe me? Now do you fucking believe me? <laughs> Flash games time. Okay, I want to see now if I can actually play some of these games. Because I have... I have a Flash game archive thing that I downloaded. Can I launch them up? Oh, dude, I have so many. Holy shit, I have an actually unbelievable amount of Flash games. Can I full screen this? I'll show it in a second. I just need to full screen it. Maybe it won't full screen? F11? That's the classic. Okay, well, either way, windowed is fine. We got so invested in that shit. That was fun. That was unironically really fun. Okay, I want to start with one of my favorites. Just kitten cannon. Is this really loud? Oh, not what I want. Alright. So here's what you do in Kitten Cannon. You adjust the angle of the cannon, and then you want to shoot it at, like, the highest, uh, the highest, like, charge. So I think we're going to go for like a nice cheeky 45 degree angle and then, or, you know, about 45 and then you launch a you launch a fucking cat. No, not the spikes. Okay. We can do better than this. We can do better than this. Maybe a bit, a bit of a lower angle. <laughs> okay. 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 No, it's fine. We got this. <laughs> Very nice shot. So we're never doing 33 again. I also think it's randomly generated. <laughs> I need to get more power, I think. There we go. There we go. Don't hit the spikes or the plant. Bro, hit some of the hit some of the things that give you speed. <laughs> I it's it's not it's not going very well at the moment. I can't lie. There we go. There we go. We'll take the trampoline. Okay. Big speed. This is a fake game that shows up in South Park. 
It's real and I'm playing it right now. Okay, 928, the score to beat. Yeah, I know, it's crazy. I feel like it's it's actually hard to not hit stuff in this game. Come on. Yeah! Big money. This is just a fucking slot machine for kids. <laughs> it's it's pure RNG. Yeah, narrow angle angle might be good, but you can you can get sucked into the plants if you do that too. Hit the trap, hit the trap, come on! Yeah. All right, come on, I can beat that 928. Let's just go like super low angle. <laughs> okay, ne ne never mind, never mind, never mind. I knew that wasn't the play. Young Tortellini lied to me. <laughs> this is how gambling begins. Accurate. Man, oh man. Come on, we can get over a thousand. For sure. For sure. For sure. Not with that kind of power we can't, because I wasn't paying attention. Bruh. Let's go like a cheeky like 22.5, you know? Come on, hit some. God damn it. You know, 90% of gamblers stop before they hit it big. That is, which is precisely why I'm not stopping at Kitten Cannon. No way. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> the cat is so fucked up, bro. There we go. There we go. Big money. Big money. Big money. Ooh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Very durable kid. Bless his heart, he just gets right back in the cannon. <laughs> or perhaps there's just multiple kittens in there. Come on. Yeah, th this doesn't have the legs. It's not getting over a thousand. I don't know, that that 928 is starting to feel pretty unbeatable. <laughs> God damn it. Alright, alright, alright. Submit your score yet to what? I have a good feeling about this one. And I don't know why. Come on. To kittencannon.org. <laughs> I don't know. I don't think I can do it. I don't think I can get over a thousand. Shame. Shame. Alright. This is crazy. There's so many games in here. I don't even know what to do. You gotta go higher to hit the nukes in the air? You might be right. <laughs> My cat is watching in shock and awe. <laughs> it's a real life snuff film for your cat. Um, did someone have a... Oh. Wait, there was like Red Ball or whatever? People were like, you've never played Red Ball? Alright. We will now. Oh, this one doesn't... Hang on. Full screen. Oh, you can full screen it. Can I change, like, the UI scale, though? Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. This is really... This is modern-day, uh... Flash gaming right here. Doesn't get better than this. Select level one. This is, like, 2D monkey ball. <laughs> This is the level goal, all right. The space jump? No, just up. <laughs> all right, I had a checkpoint. Movement tech? We <laughs> get predictions up. Mods can run predictions if they want.
Danger, okay. This music goes hard as fuck. Woo! Gaming? That's just... Just was never gonna go well. Axes. <laughs> Fuck you. Fuck you. That's evil. Wait, what do I do about this? I love how it's Axe's smiley face. Yay! Press button to destroy wall. Okay. Use R to restart? I don't need it. Oh, I do need it. <laughs> I do need it. Yeet. I'm too good. I'm too good at this game. What if you turned off the music and played Flush Person's Theme? How the fuck does this work? Play a Fury track? I'm kind of vibing to the music. Oh, you have to jump at the end. Okay, that's one of the, these are gonna fall, aren't they? That's evil. This game's evil. Ah! <laughs> Want to see that task run? It it was 40 minutes long. Bruh. <laughs> this game... This game has no jump buffering. It has absolutely no jump buffering, so you have to be touching a surface to jump. That's insane. Oh, the music didn't come back on. Well, this is awkward. <laughs> God damn it, dude. Uh... No one voted less than 20? It's almost like you all have played this game before. Or at least know more about it than I do. Oh, fuck. Son of a bitch. Wait, okay, hang on. This might be salvageable. <laughs> Come on! Alright. Guess we're listening to Chaos? Indeed. Bro. So you gotta get, like, in the funnel. That's the only way. Huh. Yep. Okay, okay, okay. Checkpoint. Oh, oh, oh. Easy, easy, easy. Box bridge. Okay, I don't like the look of this. Can't even get up here. Get to the checkpoint. Get to the checkpoint. Oh no. <laughs> you have a red ball skill issue. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, that's a checkpoint. I don't know, is this the way I want to go? It feels like there's nothing over here. Oh, fuck you. Oh, God. Wait, I think I can just get over there. Okay, wait, we go back? I don't know what that did. That was like a red key or something? It's an immersive sim. 
What happens if I go this way? <laughs> That's evil. What does the red switch do then? There, there's absolutely no universe where I ever had less than 20 deaths on this game. Alright. Come on. Come on. Why did it, it fell over so easily the first time. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. I don't know. I don't think this I don't think this gets us there. Okay, 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 okay. But what does this level look like in the speedrun? There's gotta be skips. I'm so mad. <laughs> Raging a 11 year old ball game is wild dumps 31 skill. <laughs> You, you've been here long enough, Marino, that you should know that this is not, uh, this is not off-brand. This is very similar to how my stream has always been, pretty much. Extremely on-brand. Why did I just get, like, a little pop-up? That was weird. Okay, what has changed? What did the red switch do? Jesus Christ. Are these ever gonna like sync up in a way that is actually useful to me? I can't remember if- No, dude! Oh, I already unlocked the door? What the fuck is the door? Okay, so I gotta not hit that. <laughs> Just don't- I swear I didn't touch it that time. Oh, oh, that's what that was. Oh, okay. I guess I didn't need to do it again then. That's really weird because I hit the I hit the button and then I died. All right. I, I hit twenty deaths, by the way. <laughs> if you didn't notice, you could run a prediction for more if you want. Oh, oh, oh. Get in the car. This reminds me of a fucking jelly car. Get the speed! Stay in, stay in, stay in. Gaming! <laughs> we're going, we're going. <laughs> Order fits so poorly, I beg to differ. <laughs> yes, yeah, Slave Knight Gale's theme would be better. What? Okay, what are the hitboxes on those? Gale's theme fits anything. It instantly makes anything much more epic, bro. What would you do if this was the fifth secret ultra kill level? I mean, honestly, it's about on par with the Clash of the Bandicoot. <laughs> Everything is a square, but look how, like... Well, that, that wasn't a good demonstration. <laughs> I'm just throwing my life away. No, don't, yeah, you would be stupid to believe, even for 60 deaths. <laughs> I don't know what to do here. This is a clear skill issue. Cut and dry. Yeah, I, I keep thinking I could jump over it. I believe. I think there's 15 levels is what it looks like from the menu. You have to jump like instantly, but apparently that wasn't high enough. Single sub 60 motor here. Now nah, there's two of you. Dude, ah, <laughs> ah! <sighs> 
The momentum is so awkward. I can't. <laughs> I swear the the hitbox on the on the green boxes is bigger than. Uh... Oh wait. Oh wait. Jumping like multiple times picks up. You like bounce. Do you? Yeah, you do. Well, you have to like do it perfectly. It's like it's like some frame perfect shit. Superior gamer? Hello? Oh god. Um Okay, you just bounce off him. Thank fucking god. What? That's suggestive. <laughs> that is extremely don't look, chat. <laughs> I just keep getting- I can't go directly into it. Oh, I bounced. What the- how long is this fucking level? No, dude. No. Come on. Come on. Come on. This entire no. game is an allegory for sex and birth. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm realizing that. <laughs> it wasn't quite so apparent before this level. Okay. Scorn moment. We need different music. I think Fury music was requested too. Here we go. This is what I need. Play Ship of Fools? Oh, you, just, you guys just want ultra kill music. <laughs> Oh, come on. <laughs> Turn that shit up. For gaming. Let's go. Red ball on the ball. Okay. Oh, baby. Okay. Not too bad so far. Turbo Overkill music next. I'll have to pull it up on YouTube. I don't have it in my library. Uh, that's bad. I shouldn't have committed to that. No! Oh, I thought I had the angle. Act 1 music is better than Act 2 music for Turbo Overkill? I haven't paid close enough attention to either acts to really have an opinion on that, to be honest. The the music, I should say. I thought you meant Ultra Kill, and I was like, nah, bro. <laughs> like, Act 1 music is great, but I think Act 2 music as a whole is better. <laughs> Fucking hell. You think this would fit with classical music? It kind of just makes me think of, like, uh, getting over it. It's crazy that this, that uh, my only chance isn't even a, uh, a like boss theme. Oh god, dude! It's so wild that they saved the best track in the entire game for the fucking credits. This is so evil. Come on, it's like you can't even get it rolling. Oh, now it's rolling. Now it's fucking rolling, bro. <laughs> I will say the Make This Right, the other Toxic Avengers song is also amazing. I haven't played much Fury. Is there any gameplay outside the bosses? No, but it's got like <laughs> the best bosses of for sure like any indie game that I've ever played. Yeah, there's like some secrets and stuff and a little bit of like walking simulator type shit, but no, it's uh, the all the combat is bosses. Okay, I think I've got the tech here. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Wait, why is this game actually kind of fucking good? <laughs> like, I'm, I'm getting into it. Train. <laughs> okay, don't jump. Right. We're about to hit 60. 
Now nah, I'll deathless the rest of the game. Don't don't you guys worry. <laughs> what? I thought maybe it was like telling me to get up there. <laughs> but of course, it's red. Obviously not. Do I have to like Yeah, that was quite a way to go. Okay, that kills you. I was like, maybe I'll just get a nice fling to the end here. Sorry, guys. Sorry, believers. Do I just ride the train? Like, I don't, I don't get it. So far, it, it seemed like I there's no reason for me to get out of the train. Is this just a test of patience? Does he get to the front? Oh, uh, okay, I see. So you have to jump, like, between. Oh, okay, well... <laughs> sort of flying. Alright, we got a window here. Bro, no, you, you don't, though. You have to, like, you have to pick up speed. In? Yeah! Come on, come on, come on! All that 122 trash, God. Like tears in the wind. Oh, oh, I see, the, the end is right there. Okay, 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 we can figure this out, we can figure this out. This level has the craziest speedrunning strat. Good lord. Okay, that- that was important, I think. No, that's so tough. I got very lucky with that. <laughs> ah! I got very lucky with that when I did it the first time. Yeah, I don't think I get it. I think I'm in the same spot I was before. I gotta get out on top here. I think it's the only way. It's my only chance, you might say. Check out the one you sent in Discord? Okay. Oh, it literally says get to the first cart. I'm blind. Bro, bro. Oh, come on. <laughs> oh, fuck. I messed up. I didn't know speed. I have to download the new grounds player for it, though. Okay. Oh, shit. We'll take this. God damn it. <laughs> what, what else we got here? I'm kind of just letting it run, but... <laughs> so he's a tried and true Slave Knight Gale. No, no, no. We need, uh... Let's see these. The fucking... The classic Undertale intro remixes. These are these are so hype. I think they're also very loud though. Katana Zero music? Yeah, for sure. Oh shit. <laughs> Come on, oh, I'm not tapped in. Oh, fuck. At least restarts don't count as deaths. I could cheese the Gamba this way. I won't, but I could. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. No, 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 no. Wait, do they count? Yeah, they do. Never mind, it counts. Oh, 
Why can't I get that jump there? I swear, every time I'm hitting it. Bro, 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 bro. No, I don't want to quit. I don't want to quit. Play the most DMCA able music ever. <laughs> I technically have a uh, a VOD track, so I, I actually can play DMC mu DMCA music if I want to. I just have to make sure it goes to the right track. Believe it or not, why does that jump never work? I understood what you were saying. <laughs> God damn it! 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 on oh so lucky so lucky oh, thank god come on get in there yeah let's go <laughs> oh christ almighty what is this probably this way safe to say First try. What do I just have to sub sub 100 for the prediction? <laughs> Everyone said no. Uh, I can't wait to steal your points. Genuinely. Okay, I don't think I have. Yeah, this is a problem. Okay. I knock him down like that? Oh my god, this is. This is cruel, but doable, I think. Oh, so fucking close. No. <laughs> okay, interesting. I hope that didn't count as a checkpoint. <sighs> Speedrunning this would probably be a nightmare. I'm understanding now. Okay, that's interesting. No! Oh, that was such a good position. <laughs> yeah, this feels like partially RNG, honestly. Bruh, it, it's like... I'm watching the, like, positioning of the boxes to make sure they're good, and as I do, I, like, roll back. Okay, that's very good position for the boxes. Whew, okay, nice. Okay, this has to be pushed through, which is gonna be oh so tough. Okay, that was nice. Do I even need the box? I feel like I don't. I do. I just pick up like a ton of speed and Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. This is what Pac-Man sees on MDMA. Probably, yeah. There we go. Okay, rolling it is the play. It's what I've been trying to do, but it's not. It's not very easy. Now I think I need to... Can I do it like this? Just wait for the saw to pass? Yeah, we're good. Saw con. These nuts. Never should have smoked that shit. Now I'm in red ball. We take those. <laughs> Game is frozen. Oh! <laughs> Speaking of Pac-Man... <laughs> okay, I have to hit a button to get through that. Understandable. Have a nice day, sir. Roll up that! Oh, 
attack is back. Come on. Gaming. Didn't need that jump. God damn it, I got it anyways. <laughs> Catapult, okay. Use R to restart. I always love when the level says use R to restart. That's how I know it's gonna be good. Like, what could go wrong? Oh, I see, okay. Don't fall off the edge, please. It's <laughs> just, just don't fall off the edge. That would be nice. Right, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. go, 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 go. Bitch! Stay. <laughs> and into place, into position. I like how it says one ton on it. How else would you know that it's a one ton rock? Let's go. Evil level, evil, evil level. <laughs> one of you. <laughs> I kind of, I don't know why I thought this, but I kind of thought it wouldn't roll all the way down. And off the edge. Ooh. I think we're on the last level. Shop burglary. Oh hell nah. Red Paul be committing burglary. Red Ball robs a store. Police called. Oh, we have some fucking, uh, Katana Zero up next. I'm scaling the side of the store. Oh, this is tough. I, I can maybe make it up to the second one. Yeah. Gaming? Go, 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 go. <laughs> Roll the card out, baby. <laughs> oh, no. This isn't how I want it. Oh, fuck. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> I need a little more speed than that. Okay, okay. Get the money. Dollar dollar bill, y'all. What the fuck is that? What? <laughs> oh, please. 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 A flail. Help us get fuck. <laughs> Help us get fuck. Uh oh. <laughs> no, this is death 99. Oh fuck, dude. There it is. It's <laughs> 100. Please. Where's Frita?
stay upright. <laughs> ah! <laughs> I wasn't having trouble with this before. Oh, good God. <laughs> I gotta just stop rolling right in there. Okay, okay. In the fucking- get in the car- okay, 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 okay. Red Paul X dead cells when? Good question, holy shit. How the fuck do you pick up all that speed? <laughs> I hate it, I hate it, I hate it, I hate it. I hate it, I hate it, I hate it, I hate it, I hate it. I like how I can just- Wait, are you shitting me? How the fuck is that possible? I'll be walking right over spikes. Yeah, you gotta jump- you gotta jump at the end, but you don't need the fucking cart. Get out of here. Like, what? Oh, there's more. Okay, there's more. I thought that was the final level. It says shortcut. <laughs> okay, this has got a little physics to it. Can't touch that. That's gonna fall. I knew it. 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 <laughs> what am I doing? Evil fucking game. Evil fucking game. <laughs> all that, all that just to get hit anyways. Okay. <laughs> At least I hit it. Ah! Oh! Come on. This is Sonic music. At least you didn't say it's the Ludwig song. <laughs> ah! This is the theme of Ludwig the Accursed, yes. Holy shit, I'm dead. 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 I have to just get to the end and then just pause on that last, like, ledge. <laughs> ah! How many levels are there? Oh, oh god. There's 17, okay. I guess I could hit that last one, couldn't I? OMG, it's the Ludwig song. Did you copy this song from Ludwig? <laughs> no, I just like it. Also, yes. <laughs> I'm supposed to get all the blue squares, right, chat? Fuck you. Fall Guys music? It kind of- it sounds a little bit- How did I hit that? It sounds a little bit like Fall Guys music. I can see it. Is all I'm saying. Do you remember the name of this level? Yeah, Shortcut. <laughs> There's no way. I don't believe it. What the fuck?
あー<笑>
I swear to fucking god. No dash iframes? What kind of game is this? Give me the speed. Oh, you got speed too. I can't, I can't. So you have to dash, like, away from him when he attacks. Which, yes, makes sense. However... <laughs> hungry, hungry, hungry. The nice thing is you can just kill those guys before they do anything. However, as soon as you get close to him, he attacks and you can't get away fast enough. That's the however. <laughs> I don't think I actually like this game. <laughs> Shameless Hollow Knight ripoff. Oh, we got him! Speed? Speed? We eaten. And good. What? <laughs> Imagine not having years of <laughs> don't starve kiting skills. Bro, I played that shit out of don't starve. You don't know me. Also, I don't- nothing really follows you. I hate controlling things with arrow keys. There we go. Love the art style of Don't Starve. Keep eating. We hungry. Uh-oh. I haven't found any of the fucking crack cocaine fruits. There you are. Avoid that fruit. <laughs> okay, now I need it. Okay, where is this last one? I feel like I've been almost all over the map at this point. I'm gonna run out of people to murder for their food. He's gonna be up here, no? Holy shit, the map is empty? What happened? What happened to the game froze? Okay, <laughs> pretty much. I've pretty much seen it. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> I feel like I need to at least... Okay, will this one run in browser? Oh, yes. Thank God. Can I... I feel like this is the obligatory one that I need to, uh, to end on. Okay. <laughs> God. <laughs> come on, come on, come on. <laughs> I used to be like, okay at this. I remember you could kind of just like <laughs> mash buttons. And get there. <laughs> okay. W. P. No. O. Huh. <laughs> uh. I did play Hungry Night. I'm playing Quop now. <laughs> Just as a little. Ooh.
<laughs> I, I used to be able to, like, get at least a decent distance on this game, but not anymore. I can't remember how I did it. I can't remember which thigh is controlled by which key. Bennett Foddy, you are a bastard, man. <laughs> Isn't there another one, like, GURP or whatever? Okay, wait, I think I'm doing it backwards, but... No. Yeah, Bennett Foddy made this. Uh. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Forward. No, forward! Come on. You had it. You had it. You had it. All right. That's the high score. <laughs> uh, what one point what was that? Two meters is what I got to. Oh, man. There we go. I think that's about good for the dumpster dive. We made a nice little stroll down memory lane.